Hello and good prepping to everybody. <clears throat> uh, we are still here in the in the woods during a, a hike, but I'm taking off a second to show a little bit what's inside my uh, lunch bag. First of all, this is a bag. It's it's a nylon bag. It's really thin. It's like silk. I mean, it's almost the same kind of uh, kind of material used to. Uh, make the parachutes. It's really lightweight and it's very resistant. So inside it, oh, I forgot. I have the bottle. I don't like using um, specific canteens. They're too uh, too heavy. Just normal PET bottles are perfect. They can uh, <clears throat> overcome a lot of uh, stress heat and um, and pressure from the inside so I think it's really the perfect canteen that you can use for uh, bugging out or anyway for hiking and trekking inside the the lunch box I have this is my whey bread it's a particular recipe that I've been uh, putting on uh, after a little bit of study on, um, on diet, I mean, on alimentary uh, issues. Um, it's, it can be a substitute, a total substitute of a full uh, meal because it has proteins, um, carbohydrates and, um, and fat in the almost perfect um, combination. So it's pretty good for that. Uh, it's really lightweight because there's no water inside it's cooked until it's totally dry and it can last for a very long time I've done this during the winter so it's about five or six months uh, old and it's still perfect even if there's an egg inside so <clears throat> it's really a good thing I think I remember it was around um, 3,500 um, calories per kilo uh, should be around that maybe something more so it's a pretty nice lightweight uh, meal to bring for an emergency or anyway for to go backpacking then I have peanuts uh, you can bring, bring uh, peanut butter or just peanuts as you prefer uh, I usually bring uh, peanuts so I just can eat them while walking also and have dry fruit it's just the things you can buy in the supermarket or sometimes when I I have the time and I have the um, the ingredients I prefer to dry my own uh, fruits from I mean from the farm it's they get much better and then uh, they have much more um, more taste than the one you buy I don't know why but it's much better anyway <clears throat> oh, this is already open I've been using it already half of it these are dry uh, dry meals you just put it in the water cook it uh, boil it for three or four minutes and it's ready this one should be around uh, 356 calories per 100 grams so it's it's pretty nice to have it at night when it's maybe gets a little bit cold it's anyway a good idea to have a hot meal <clears throat> uh, this is my mm, my breakfast bag there's a um, uh, this is dried milk that I've done and you can see in the I've been talking about in the blog then you have muesli uh, with nuts and fruits and cereal uh, also this is about um, a kind of meal that can have around 350 uh, 400 um, calories per 100 grams so it's uh, pretty lightweight and it's nice for, um, for any kind of backpacking. What else? 
and oh I forgot the beef jerky beef jerky inside here I've been doing that by myself and I like it uh, during lunchtime if you're walking you're moving or you just don't want to uh, light the volcano stove it's just a fast way to have um, to have a lunch some things that I don't have inside uh, the bag but I usually have um, in the belt I mean of uh, of my backpack is um, chocolate bars I've been doing that also by myself because I mix chocolate with um, uh, with muesli also with nuts and cocoa uh, sorry um, coconut and I like making them because I can mix it and uh, reach a higher calories level than with just chocolate uh, I mean not a higher um, only a higher um, calories rate but it's it has more um, more ingredients so you have you can have uh, fat and you can have uh, proteins inside and uh, also carbohydrates as you have uh, normally in chocolate so it's um, it's a way that just walking and hiking you just put it, uh, your hand in the belt pick it out and have a start of um, a start up uh, with energy the same is I do it with honey also and almost the other things uh, the same thing so this is about what I bring for my uh, hikings and what I usually have in any kind of bug out bag I have uh, around.